In this video we will demonstrate how to include a new BNF in OpenMano, how to create an scenario that uses it and how to deploy this scenario. As we can see in the graphical user interface we already have three BNFs. We have a generator from vendor Telefonica and two virtual routers from vendor A and vendor B. We are going to include a third router that is going to come from vendor C. This is what Vendor C has provided us. It's an image and a descriptor of the BNF. We are going to copy this image to a location that is going to be accessible for us. In this case, we are going to copy it to a directory that is exported through NFS, but it could be any other method. And now we are going to edit the descriptor to uh, modify the path of the image and we're going to review the, the descriptor a little bit. Okay, so here we see uh, the name of the of the VNF, we see the external connections, uh, we see restrictions about processor, hypervisor, memory, interfaces, and in here we have uh, the image file that is going to be used. So we add the same path that we'll, where we copy the image and we save it. Now we are ready to include this BNF in, in OpenMano. So we just type OpenMano BNF create and the name of the file. So it's already in there. Okay, we see it. We can also see it in the graphical user interface. Here it is, router C. So now we can create the, the scenario. So we go to the scenarios tab, we click on new. Uh, we only have to drag and drop all the VNFs. We are gonna add external connectivity and just draw the links in this scenario we have created the generator is gonna create a, a traffic load that is going to go through, uh, through these three routers using this path here that is uh, going through router B or this one that is going directly from A to C and the other way around. And we are going to also create uh, connectivity for management. So we are ready to save, almost. Uh, we have to include an scenario name, for example, test, description test. Okay, save. And we get a success message, it's working. And now we have here test ready to use. So we only have to deploy. We have to say a name for this instance, so for example, test instance. We get another success message. And now we have the instance of the scenario running. We see it. We can also see it uh, from the physical. So we know where the virtual machines are running. If it were necessary to make uh, any modification configuration to the BNFs, it could be done now and safe afterwards. So what we are going to do now is to open a display from the generator and start generating, and generating traffic. So we are going to see how the generator is able to send to this scenario and receive from it a full line rate that is uh, 40 gigabits per second. And we are going to see uh, how it's handling it uh, in also in terms of million of packets per second. Okay, so we're we have it. 
Uh, here we have it. Uh, we see the throughput in terms of gigabits per second. We see its uh, full line rate. We also see the throughput in million of packets per second. This is an area it's uh, giving full performance. It was easy to deploy. That's all. Thanks.